This is the MC1 Plus charger from XSTAR. What makes this charger unique and different than other chargers on the market, that for its size, it is a one amp charger, making it the smallest and most powerful charger on the market for its form factor and size. It uses XSTAR's uh, intelligent charger technology that stops charging at a perfect 4.2 volts. For the price, the charging speed, the quality from XSTAR, it can't be beat. Before we go into the demonstration phase of this video, we need to discuss uh, AC to USB wall adapters. They are not equal. They are not the same and they vary in quality greatly. This is a Joytech charger from maybe three years ago. It was always a piece of junk. Um, it, it doesn't follow any good uh, standards. It's a little bit of a weirdo uh, uh, charger. And we actually have a device that can check that. And this is a Kanger email kit. Uh, charger and the uh, owner of Kanger Tech actually showed me this and wanted to show me that it was UL listed and it works really well as uh, um, a AC to USB wall adapter and even if you don't vape it's worth picking one of these up we haven't had any complaints we have bought it and sold maybe 500 of these by themselves we're going to show you how to get the most out of your charger and the difference between these two uh, AC to USB wall adapters this is an XSTAR USB detector. Now, they shouldn't have called it a USB detector because it doesn't detect USBs. Um, it's really a USB multimeter and amp meter. It's very handy. Now, I wouldn't normally talk up something not vape related, except that this can be used for not just vaping charging, but any kind of charger. You charge your cell phone, portable hard drive, portable power banks. I think anybody who uses anything USB that requires a battery charge has to have one of these. Um, you can re easily find a charger that can charge your phone twice as fast just by finding the best port in your house. So this is what we're going to be using. We sell it for $4.99. We're going to be connecting the MC1 Plus to that and finding out uh, the difference between these two chargers. But we just wanted to give you a quick rundown of what this was. So here's the MC1 Plus. It's plugged in. It's ready to go. Um, now. XSTAR says it adjusts between 1 amp and 0.5 of an amp. I don't know how it makes that determination on what it needs or um, what setting it should be on. I'm going to assume that it, it varies on the quality of the USB port itself, how fast this will charge. Um, and if this is charging at 1 amp, you should see something close to 1 amp on the XSTAR USB detector. If you got a good um, USB AC adapter you shouldn't see too much voltage sag when we uh, put a load on it also to see if uh, a device is draining power with nothing on it or if it's turned off you can see it should flip between voltage of this and then the amperage drain which should be close to zero or zero one here we go still within spec 5.09 and it's about one amp right there. So we know that because this is charging at, uh, putting out still a, a five volts under load and charging at one amp, that this is probably gonna charge to a perfect 4.19 or 4.20, because that's how XSTAR designed their chargers. All right, now we've plugged in the MC1 Plus to a three-year-old Joytech um, AC to USB wall adapter. Uh, this came with a starter kit a few years ago. Now, a few years ago, uh, chargers or the batteries themselves were known for catching on fire. Um, I believe partially because these were not up to spec. Um, they weren't uh, putting out the right voltage and amperage and overcharging batteries, and those batteries were actually combusting because of the poor quality USB power from the wall itself. Um, it's just a theory. I have no proof of that. But what you're going to see here is something really strange. Now, if you look already, and we'll see, it's 5.32. It's already kind of on the high side, if not out of spec. I believe the spec for USB is 5.35 at the highest. So it's already kind of high. Now, we're going to put a 1 amp load to this half amp charger. And it should just cap off at half an amp, from what I understand. Its voltage sag is 4.38. Look at that. Now, if I use this charger, this low quality charger, to charge this, it'll probably charge it a little bit overcharged. We've noticed that with the low quality uh, USB to uh, AC to USB adapters, we've been noticing um, overcharging on USB devices. Um, so, what does this mean to you as a consumer? Uh, it's real simple. If you got one of these no name, 
uh, not UL listed, junky AC to USB wall adapters, especially if you find it doesn't charge an Apple product, because a lot of these will not charge Apple products. I don't know if that's a uh, safety feature Apple put in. Throw it in the trash. It's not worth having. This is a quality one from Kanger. I'm sure it's a rebrand that Kanger just bought it off somebody else and stuck their name on it. But it works great. Charges at one amp. My phone charges faster with it. And they're everywhere. I mean, if you've had cell phones in the past, um, Apple, Samsung, HTC, they usually always come with a quality USB dongle. There's no reason to keep one of these cheap ones around. And especially if you're charging uh, something like an 18650 cylindrical battery, just do yourself a favor and toss it and get something that's more reliable and well known. So who's this charger for? This charger's for anyone looking for a smaller footprint but wants uh, a big package. One amp charging means you can charge a Sony VTC5 or a Samsung 25R in about three hours. Um, one amp's usually the standard for a lot of chargers on the higher end. There's a few two amp chargers out there. Xstar makes two that I know of. Um, but most people are charging at one amp. And, you know, I don't like carrying batteries around. I'd rather have a stash of batteries at my workstation at work, at my home. And uh, if I need to charge one in my car, I would buy three of these for the price uh, of a lot of other chargers and have one of these everywhere I go. Um, Xstar is a well known brand. Uh, they set the standard in quality charging and we carry it here at Sun Vapors along with a variety of other chargers, XStar MC1 Plus.